and welcome to Watford TV, sponsored by West Fear. I'm Daisy Savage and today I'm here with Simply the Jest. How are you today? Good. Good. <laughs> it's good. Good. And can you tell us a little bit about your show? Uh, Simply the Jest, we are a nine strong sketch comedy group um, and yeah, we market ourselves as the largest sketch group in Edinburgh for this year and we're doing a whole month run just the top. So sketches, songs, parodies, occurring characters, observations and stuff, all sorts of things. Yeah, and you're one man down, is that correct? Yes. Yeah. How has that changed your show? Are you able to cope? Luckily, with being sort of nine of us, we've been able to sort of step in and, and cover uh, Rosie's sketches after, after she unfortunately yeah. injured quite a lot. How did she do that? She got hit by a motorbike. Which is, it happens was an that hour. out of the fringe? Yeah. yeah. Oh, About six, okay. six shows in. It happened an hour before the show, so that was fun. That was a panic <laughs> tonight. Yeah, and um, our friend Zach stayed with her, and so we had to work the show without both of them, um, just for a night, and then obviously afterwards we've been trying to work it without but I've been to visit her and she's, she's doing well. Yeah. yeah, she's recovering, so it's good. So it's your third time in the fringe. Yes. Yeah. How has your show changed three years? Um, after the first year we started writing sketches. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, just sort of coming up with them and going, that, that yeah. will do. Yeah, we um, literally improvised everything. Yeah. And it sort of just sort of honed it. Honed it. And of course the rehearsals, but now... We, like we say, write everything. We start with writing and then we kind of mess around with it and go through the editing process that way. It works much better for us and we've improved a lot since our first year. So it's a much tighter hour. Yeah. In the first year we had about 24 sketches and now we've got about 37. <laughs> Yeah. And they link in with each other, which is good, so it feels more like a piece rather than it being quite bitsy. Which and you're the best at executing. Yes. yes. And then you will continue to do the sketch group afterwards. Yeah. yeah. I mean, one of our members has just graduated from that, so for the rest of us, we've, we've had a year to do our own thing, and uh, obviously it was something that we really wanted to kind of carry on yeah. out in the world. Yeah, it's nice to stay together. Yeah. yeah. Definitely. So what are you doing for the rest of the year then? When you're not at the fringe? Uh, I've just graduated from drama school. Well, then I um, just got the hug! It's been the third of us, and then Jack, you're which you've been working at uh, Richmond Theatre. Do press and marketing work right there, which is great. It's a lot of fun, and it's really nice to talk because it's part time, so I'm also able to do this as well. Days of the I'm working as a waitress, it's great. <laughs> um, working, doing like stuff in a pharmacy, it's all very boring. <laughs> but this is what, you know, this is where my passion lies. And I've been doing, yeah, I've been watching the drama school this year on a couple of waiting lists. But I don't know, I think I really want to focus on this now. It's, you know, we've had a really good time. We really want to, our passion is comedy. So, and I think we've really, you know, it's good. So, what do you like about Fringe so much? It's just so, it's so vibrant. Yeah. It's, um, it's nice just to do the show every night and, and develop it over uh, every performance is just that little bit better than, than the one before yeah. and we tweak and we hone and, and yeah, it's, it's, it's just really nice to have that opportunity that you don't, you don't have for the rest of the year. It feels like the opportunity to kind of come together with loads of other comedy groups and acts, like this is the one place you go to, yeah. to, to see exactly what's kind of going on in the comedy scene at the moment. Yeah, exactly. So it means that you can, any time of the day, you can go out and see various different acts in it. and it's nice, it feels like you're kind of supporting yeah. other comedy groups and, and, yeah. and trying to sort of help them along as well. And everyone knows everyone and it's, it's so nice to also be kind of interacting with comedians that have been, been going in the business for years and they're there to give you support as well. I've met quite a lot of people that are really supportive up here. Yeah. It's just nice to just be surrounded by it all just for a month. You just don't get that in London really, do you? 